Hey fellow tennis nerds, this is a video of me testing Nick Kyrgios alleged setup with his Yonex XI98. So bad boy Nick Kyrgios seems to create headlines wherever he goes, uh, besides sometimes walking in Bernard Tomic footsteps when it comes to effort or I would say lack of effort on the court. He can also show his amazing talent and feel. He has beaten Djokovic, Federer, Nadal and can go from brilliant to ridiculous in a heartbeat. Recently he won the ATP 500 event in Acapulco after an impressive streak of wins including uh, Zverev and Nadal. But we still have no idea how good he will be in his next tournament. So it's kind of a love-hate thing for most people around Nick Kyrgios. I conducted a small, small Instagram poll where it seems like his believers and fans are still in the majority. We all like to see him when he plays well, but sometimes he just goes off the rails in a quite nasty way. So Kyrgios plays with a Yonex XI-98. It's quite easy to see uh, that his current stick is a paint job because the XI-98 is more squarish in the head. Uh, he plays it with a leather grip and some lead tape at 10 and 2 to bring it up to 340 grams strong. I don't know the balance of this stick. His actual racket has been sold on forums for uh, a hefty sum, but these are the specs that are known. Um, he's endorsing Yonex Politor Pro String, a 120 gauge. So that is what I used for this test, but I've heard from reputable sources that he's actually using a softer non-commercial Yonex string that is um, that he strings around 25 kilos. So I don't know his balance with his racket, but mine was at 343 grams, 31.8 centimeter balance. His specs might be a bit heavier in the head because a lot of pros use hefty swing weights, but if you look at how much pace he generates with his really fast arm and swing, I think it might not be the case. I think he might actually be playing with this kind of balance. So I've played with pretty much all ESO 98s through the years. I've never tried the XI 98, partly because it's a bit stiffer. I tend to stay away from stiffer rackets, but also partly because it's quite hard to find these days. So let's look at the specs of the XI 98. It's a 98 square inch racket, obviously, 27 inches, 310 grams unstrung, beam width of 23, 24 and 19.5 millimeters. The balance is five points head light. Flex is 66 RA, plays slightly stiffer I would say. A string pattern 1619 and a swing weight around 322 strong. Quite maneuverable racket, quite a lot of fun to play with, offers a lot of power. So the first few hits I really noticed the stiffer feel compared to the AI-98, which I really like. This racket plays closer to a pure drive when it comes to the power and how the ball explodes from the string bed with pace. Spin is quite nice too, uh, however, if you would compare it to a Yonex uh, V-Core 98, uh, which is a very similar racket in stiffness and feel, I would say that offers a bit better spin. So the spin here is a bit more controlled, slightly lower launch angle, but it's very powerful, this racket. So um, I wanted to be inspired by Kyrgios for this session, so I went on full blasts and crazy uh, a lot of the time, play some silly tennis at times, not very consistent. I'm not even 10% uh, as talented as he is, So, uh, but I like to play around and, and uh, play creatively. So that's always fun and it sure is entertaining when it works, but uh, it comes at the price. Of uh, some shots I was thumping for winners, other times I had a hard time finding the range because it's so powerful. Uh, I thought I would feel it more in my wrist and arm after the session, but it felt fine. I'm still not surprised considering how stiff this racket is and, and, and if you look at Kyrgios' technique, that he has suffered elbow injuries um, quite recently. So his really fast arm action, um, it looks like it could uh, almost tear off an elbow. So it's a fun hit, this racket, the XI-98. As I struggled to control the power, as I said, I felt quite stable on volleys. Really nice uh, on serves, as most powerful sticks are. I think this is definitely more of a pure drive in a 98 square head size. I personally prefer the feel of the AI or DR a bit more because it's a more flexible feel. I I feel a bit more connected to the string bed, but uh, it's not a bad racket, it's quite fun to hit. You can see why uh, Kyrgios uses it for his very explosive style with a lot of pace and um, some really interesting shot selections. If you find one, I urge you to, to try it out. Could be an interesting stick to use, but there's, there's quite a few 98 square inch rackets that are 
good these days. So on a closing note, it will be fun to see what results Kyrgios will follow his win in Acapulco with. As I said in the beginning, it's almost impossible to tell. He might win the tournament in Indian Wells or he might lose the first round. So that's uh, gonna be very interesting to see. Thanks for watching this short Tennis Nerd video. As always, I appreciate every like, share and subscribe. Please also check me out on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook as well as TennisNerd.net where you will find lots of articles and info around pro player gear, tennis rackets and strings. Have a nice day and I hope you get to play some tennis. Thank you.